Phenethylamine, Wikipedia article audio. Phenethylamine, also known as beta phenylethylamine and 2 phenylethan 1 amine, is an organic compound, natural monoamine alkaloid, and trace amine which acts as a central nervous system stimulant in humans. Natural occurrence Phenylethylamine functions as a monoaminergic neuromodulator and, to a lesser extent, a neurotransmitter in the human central nervous system. It is biosynthesized from the amino acid L-phenylalanine by enzymatic decarboxylation via the enzyme aromatic L-amino acid decarboxylase. In addition to its presence in mammals, phenethylamine is found in many other organisms and foods such as chocolate, especially after microbial fermentation. It is sold as a dietary supplement for purported mood and weight loss related therapeutic benefits, however, in orally ingested phenethylamine, a significant amount is metabolized in the small intestine by monoamine oxidase B and then aldehyde dehydrogenase, which convert it to phenylacetic acid. This means that for significant concentrations to reach the brain, the dosage must be higher than for other methods of administration. Phenethylamines, or more properly, substituted phenethylamines are the group of phenethylamine derivatives which contain phenethylamine as a backbone, in other words, this chemical class includes derivative compounds that are formed by replacing one or more hydrogen atoms in the phenethylamine core structure with substituents. The class of substituted phenethylamines includes all substituted amphetamines, and substituted methylenedioxyphenethylamines, and contains many drugs which act as M pathogens, stimulants, psychedelics, anorectics bronchodilators, decongestants, and slash or antidepressants, among others. Chemistry Phenethylamine is produced by a wide range of species throughout the plant and animal kingdoms, including humans, it is also produced by certain fungi and bacteria and acts as a potent antimicrobial against certain pathogenic strains of Escherichia coli at sufficient concentrations. Substituted derivatives Phenethylamine is a primary amine, the amino group being attached to a benzene ring through a 2-carbon, or ethyl group. It is a colorless liquid at room temperature that has a fishy odor and is soluble in water, ethanol, and ether. Its density is 0.964 g ml and its boiling point is 195 degrees Celsius. Upon exposure to air, it combines with carbon dioxide to form a solid carbonate salt. Phenethylamine is strongly basic, pKb equals 4.17, as measured using the HCl salt and forms a stable crystalline hydrochloride salt with a melting point of 217 degrees Celsius. Synthesis Substituted phenethylamines are a chemical class of organic compounds that are based upon the phenethylamine structure. The class is composed of all the derivative compounds of phenethylamine which can be formed by replacing or substituting, one or more hydrogen atoms in the phenethylamine core structure with substituents. Detection in body fluids Many substituted phenethylamines are psychoactive drugs which belong to a variety of different drug classes, including central nervous system stimulants, hallucinogens, intoctogens, appetite suppressants, nasal decongestants, and bronchodilators antidepressants, anti-Parkinson agents, and vasopressors, among others. Many of these psychoactive compounds exert their pharmacological effects primarily by modulating monoamine neurotransmitter systems, however, there is no mechanism of action or biological target that is common to all members of this subclass. Pharmacology 
numerous endogenous compounds including hormones, monoamine neurotransmitters, and many trace amines are substituted phenethylamines. Several notable recreational drugs, such as MDMA, methamphetamine, and cathinones, are also members of the class. All of the substituted amphetamines are phenethylamines as well. Pharmaceutical drugs that are substituted phenethylamines include phenylzine, phenformin, and phanatizole, among many others. Pharmacodynamics Pharmacokinetics Notes One method for preparing beta-phenethylamine, set forth in J. C. Robinson's and H. R. Snyder's organic syntheses, involves the reduction of benzyl cyanide with hydrogen in liquid ammonia, in the presence of a rainy nickel catalyst, at a temperature of 130 degrees Celsius and a pressure of 13.8 MPa. Alternative syntheses are outlined in the footnotes to this preparation. A much more convenient method for the synthesis of beta-phenethylamine is the reduction of omega-nitrostyrene by lithium aluminum hydride in ether, whose successful execution was first reported by R. F. Nystrom and W. G. Brown in 1948. Phenethylamine can also be produced via the cathodic reduction of benzyl cyanide in a divided cell. It is possible to assemble phenethylamine structures for synthesis of compounds such as epinephrine, amphetamines, tyrosine, and dopamine by adding the beta aminoethyl side chain to the phenyl ring. This can be done via friedel crafts acylation with N protected acyl chlorides when the arene is activated or by HEC reaction of the phenyl with N-vinyl oxazolone, followed by hydrogenation, or by cross-coupling with beta-amino-organozinc reagents, or reacting a brominated arene with beta-aminoethyl-organolithium reagents, or by Suzuki cross-coupling. Reviews that cover attention deficit hyperactivity disorder and phenethylamine indicate that several studies have found abnormally low urinary phenethylamine concentrations in ADHD individuals when compared with controls. In treatment responsive individuals, amphetamine and methylphenidate greatly increase urinary phenethylamine concentration. An ADHD biomarker review also indicated that urinary phenethylamine levels could be a diagnostic biomarker for ADHD. Skydiving induces a marked increase in urinary phenethylamine concentrations. 30 minutes of moderate to high intensity physical exercise has been shown to induce an enormous increase in urinary phenylacetic acid, the primary metabolite of phenethylamine. Two reviews noted a study where the mean 24-hour urinary phenylacetic acid concentration following just 30 minutes of intense exercise rose 77% above its base level. The reviews suggest that phenethylamine synthesis sharply increases during physical exercise during which it is rapidly metabolized due to its short half-life of roughly 30 seconds. In a resting state, Phenethylamine is synthesized in catecholamine neurons from L-phenylalanine by aromatic amino acid decarboxylase at approximately the same rate as dopamine is produced. Because of the pharmacological relationship between phenethylamine and amphetamine, the original paper and both reviews suggest that phenethylamine plays a prominent role in mediating the mood-enhancing euphoric effects of a runner's high as both phenethylamine and amphetamine are potent euphorians. Phenethylamine, being similar to amphetamine in its action at their common biomolecular targets, releases norepinephrine and dopamine. Phenethylamine also appears to induce acetylcholine release via a glutamate-mediated mechanism. Phenethylamine has been shown to bind to two human trace amine-associated receptors, HTAAR1 and HTAAR2, as an agonist. By oral route, phenylethylamine's half-life is 5-10 minutes, 
endogenously produced P in catecholamine neurons has a half-life of roughly 30 seconds. In humans, P is metabolized by phenylethanolamine and methyltransferase, monoamine oxidase A, monoamine oxidase B, the semicarbazide-sensitive amine oxidases AOC2 and AOC3, flavin-containing monooxygenase 3, and aerochylamine and acetyltransferase. N-methylphenethylamine, an isomer of amphetamine, is produced in humans via the metabolism of phenethylamine by PNMT. Beta-phenylacetic acid is the primary urinary metabolite of phenethylamine and is produced via monoamine oxidase metabolism and subsequent aldehyde dehydrogenase metabolism. Phenylacetaldehyde is the intermediate product which is produced by monoamine oxidase and then further metabolized into beta-phenylacetic acid by aldehyde dehydrogenase. When the initial phenylethylamine concentration in the brain is low, brain levels can be increased 1,000-fold when taking a monoamine oxidase inhibitor, particularly a MAOB inhibitor, and by 3-4 times when the initial concentration is high.